And welcome in, everybody. Glad you're with us. We've got baseball on the show. It's the St. Louis Cardinals going up against the Atlanta Braves. First pitch coming your way next. And now, your 2028 Atlanta Braves. And next for Atlanta, King Tejada. Four for four last night. Hitter's got some good opposite field power. What I like about something being hit to the right side into the outfield is that the base runner at second has a very good read and can determine oh whether or not he can score on that base hit. And a pitch. And look out as that one ran in and got him. Well, that pitch right there didn't even snip the zone. He was all out of whack on that delivery. So first and second Ozzie. with one man gone. Here's the second baseman, Ozzie Albies. Misses inside, and it's two and one. At this point, the clean inning is over. Got to settle in, focus on the hitter, and get out of it with minimal damage. The pitch. This one popped up. And that's a fair ball. And they stop him at third, so base is loaded with one away. Batting six, the third baseman, Austin. Here's Austin Riley. Riley. Pitch misses there. Now two balls and a strike. At the dish, looking to lift the ball in the air in this spot. Anything but the inning, inning double play, Boog. And he deals on the ground. And it's just foul. That was close. But I think ultimately you want to tie him up, get the ball in on the plate so that he can't get the barrel to it and hit it to the outfield. Three and two now. That is ball four, and that'll bring home a run. He's really gotten himself into a mess out there and now forces home a run with the wall. This inning's definitely getting away from him. So base is loaded with one away. So now to the plate for Atlanta, Sean Murphy. And that's in for a strike. Well, they're really running up the pitch count in this first inning. Lots of confidence from this team that is perhaps the hottest in baseball right now. One and two here. Battling here as he fouls it away. Definitely got the hitter conscious of the pitch inside. I really think the outer half is open. At the belt and fires. Got him! Huge strike out there. Well, big power guy right there and generating so much bat speed. It's hard Batting. to bring that to Don't a halt you. once you've committed. They tried to check the swing, just couldn't do it. Now in for the Braves, Jacob Melton. Ball to strike. The pitch got the bat going too oh, soon at strike two. Tejada at third, Albies on second, Riley on at first with two down. That one misses. Two balls, two strikes. Man, oh man, I don't know how you take that pitch. That's as close as it gets. Next offering misses, counts full, three and two. He's really tightening up his hitting zone with two strikes here, I love it. Swing and a miss, struck him out. Well, this guy competes hard, we see the emotion there, I love it. Great job of getting out of the jam. Now up for St. Louis, Kelvin Gutierrez. He struck out swinging at his first at bat. Bounced out to short, Tejada. Tosses across the first, third out, and that ends the frame. One run in the inning, but they leave two. Now to the bottom of the second. 
It's the Braves two and the Cardinals one. So runner at no second, two down. Two. Now the Atlanta Shortstop cleanup up. hitter, King yeah. Tejada. He's been such a good hitter with runners in scoring position. Some guys just take it to another level. For him right now at the plate, it's like everyone else is in slow motion and he's in full speed. This one smacked out to left center. He dives, but he can't make the catch. To second now, but he's safe. And a run comes in to score. And that keeps his hitting streak going. He's making this look way easier than it is, Boo. Setting the record is hard enough, but to keep up in it every day like he is, I don't really know what to say anymore. At this point, it honestly feels like it's never going to end. Absolutely remarkable. Here is Ozzie Albies up to hit. And he's already singled in this game. Bounce to the left side. Fair ball. Run comes in from second, and they lead by four. A couple of hits in a row for him here. Just found a way to slap that ball down the third baseline. That's really excellent back control, and it kind of goes back to all those drills you see hitters do off the tee where it's placed in different spots. That was just nice. So one out, nobody on. King Tejada now at the plate. The shortstop, King Tejada. That one pushed foul. Right-hander kicks, deals. On a line, base hit. Wasting no time. He's now two for two Second now on hit. the night. And Aubrey. just a triple and home run Aubrey. away from the cycle. Seriously, we're starting with this already. Ozzie Albies up to the plate. Runner! There goes the runner. Gets a piece there. We'll do it again. Tejada stands at first with one out. He's going, he's runner going, goes going. again. Knocks that one away, and we'll do it again. Runner goes again. Pitch outside. Throw to second and great jump. Clearly not content with the lead they're working with right now, and I like that. I don't think you can get comfortable with a five-run lead in today's game, and now they've got a good chance of adding on. The kick, the 3-2. Swings and misses. It's a strikeout. Couldn't catch up to the heater. Here's the third baseman, Austin Riley. Third baseman, Austin. He's a good high school football player, Austin Riley. But you look at the build, you think quarterback, think maybe even linebacker. No, he's a punter. Here's a 1-1. Check swing. Tried to hold up. Now an appeal to first. And he went around. That's ruled a swing. Two outs and one in scoring position. Swings and misses, struck him out. Braves strand one. They lead it though, 6 1. Man in scoring no position with two away. Here's a speed threat, King Tejada. Good swing out of him last time. Ripped a liner in the center. Hey, you got it. Going back. Let's go. That one missed. Oh, that's down. Ball. Runner at second. Two down. Hey, wait for yours here. Fouled off left side. Runner leads away at second. And that one is lifted in the air. Corson moving under it. Makes the grab, and that'll end the inning. 
King Tejada. Next up for the Braves. The batter, number two, shortstop, King Tejada. Swing and a miss. Strike one. Looks like he went up there guessing on the first pitch and was going to sell out to it. Didn't make any contact, though. Swing and a deep drive. This one's got a chance. Way back there, and boom goes the dynamite. He sends a rocket to left, and they boost their lead. It's 10-3. Zingy, he's been red hot. Yeah, another big swing of the bat for him. Man, he has really seen the ball well in this one. <laughs> Looks like this guy was looking out over the plate, but he was ready to turn on the inside fastball. So direct to the pitch, absolutely blasted out of this ballpark. Ready to begin the eighth, and stepping in for the Cardinals, Brenton Doyle. Jerpy, back to work. Out to short, Tejada. Throw to first, great stretch, and they got him. The center fielder, number 25, Chuck Corsett. When you win five in a row, the confidence just goes to another level, and you start to gain this momentum, and you think that you're never going to lose a game again because things are clicking up and down the lineup. Pitchers are pitching. Guys are making the plays defensively. This is the kind of feeling. It's not going to last all season long, but you want to ride it as long as you possibly can, perhaps push it up to double digits. And your final, 